Uh, what, what we do as divers, Navy divers, uh, is pretty dangerous. The recompression chamber, it's a benefit to have. Uh, if we get hurt and there's no recompression chamber, it could be a serious problem. Right now we're working with the Coast Guard here in Belize. Uh, we brought the TRCS, uh, the Transportable Recompression Chamber System. Well, a recompression chamber, uh, basically it's, it's just a tube. Uh, you know, we, we're able to push air into it and pressurize it, and it simulates depth. Interlock. Eric, can you hear me? So then I want you to check the tightness of them. Three valves in there. Equalization valves, exhaust valves. Running the chamber is a, a big evolution. Load to 75 PSI. If we're having to run it, it means somebody's hurt. Someone got hurt in the water, and we're, we're trying to take care of them. We're trying to treat them in the chamber. Secured? Secured. Secondary bibs, oxygen supply, control valve, OPV7 closed. Shut. It is a meticulous procedure to set up the chamber and everything like that, but it's a, it's a blessing to have on the side. Um, I wouldn't want to make a dive without one around because you know if you do get hurt, it'll be right there on the side helping you out. I'm Indy 2, Mitch Baker. I'm a diver with Mudsuit 2. I'm down here in Belize with Southern Partnership Station.